Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys an, a painting art hack that I found on YouTube and um, the YouTuber that I found it from was so craftastic. So if you want to check her channel out, go do that. She's a very good artist YouTuber. So yeah, let's get on with the video. So for this hack, um, you're going to be needing um, acrylic paint. Um, you can use one or two colors depending on what you want and you'll need a place to put your paint in. You will also need um, the amount of strings as you have paint. So if you have two paints, then you'll need two strings like I have here. And your hands will get messy for this, so I do recommend wearing gloves, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna try to keep them the least messy as possible. You're also gonna need a piece of paper. So, you're going to just squeeze out your acrylic paint into your container. Just a little bit, you don't need a lot. And you're going to squeeze your next color. I'm using red and green, you can use any colors you want. And guys, comment down below if you want me to post more um, painting videos. And I can actually do painting tutorials. So, um, then you're going to kind of like, I don't know, like crumple up the piece of string like this, and you're going to dip it into the paint. And I'm actually going to use something to dip it in. Uh, here, I'm going to use the end of this paintbrush to dip it into the paint because I don't want to get my hands dirty. So I'm going to be putting this string into the red paint, and you can just like flip it around make sure all the string gets paint on it, but make sure that um, a little bit of it doesn't have paint on it, because you will need to be, you're going to touch that part. So just make sure that a little bit of it does not have paint. Try to not get them mixed up like I did. So then take out your string and um, try to straighten it out. And then, yes, I just got paint on my paper, but whatever. Um, you're going to um, put it on your paper. So I'm gonna put it on my paper, and you're just gonna kind of overlap it, and then make sure you're leaving the clean part off of the paper like this. And then for the next string, you're gonna do the same thing, and I'm going to clean this paintbrush afterwards, so don't worry, this paintbrush is not going to be dirty. I'm going to clean it right after this video. So then you're going to put this string into the green. And it's okay if they mix up a little bit, but just not a lot. And this hack works really great if you're not that good at painting, or even if you are good at painting, but you just want to try this out because it looks really cool in the end. So then you're going to put the put the string on your paper, and you can make the two strings overlap. Kind of just put it down randomly. And then once you do that, you can either put a paper on top of the paper that you already put the string on, or you can just fold the paper in half like I'm doing. And then you're gonna press down. And then, I want you guys to see this. You're gonna take both strings and you're gonna pull, pull them out. You can kind of like move the strings around in the paper um, and just pull them out and keep pulling until the string is all out. Sorry, my hand is in the way, and my arm is in the way. And then just pull it all out. And then you can set the string aside. You won't need it anymore. You can throw it away. But inside is going to be a design. And I'm going to flip my camera around. And now you can see me. And I'm going to open it up. There will be the same design on both sides of the paper. If you choose to do it the way I did. And it looks so cool. And every design turns out differently. I will show you guys some of the ones I've already did right now. I did a cookie 
couple of things. So, yeah. I don't know where my other ones are. Oh, here. Here's another one. I really like. Alright, so. I started a couple, like I said. Um, so, here's one that I did that's blue. There's two colors of blue. <laughs> so, yeah. There's that. And then there's also this other red and green one. And then there's also this blue and red one. Yeah. And you can get super creative with these. You can add more colors. You can make even make it a rainbow. You can like outline them after with Sharpie. Um, but no matter what you do, it will always turn out good no matter what you do. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let's try to get this video to 10 thumbs up. So, yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.